What is the equation of motion for an elevator of mass m accelerating down? Assume constant acceleration due to gravity g and acceleration a. Welcome to hdtvedu.com, direct and simple education in seconds. You watch, you play, you pause, you learn. We are told that the elevator of mass m is accelerating down. If acceleration is down, net force is down. If net force is down, the bigger force has to act vertically down. Bigger force by small force equals net force. What is the bigger force? The gravitational force. Why? The net force is down. If net force is down, the force down has to be greater than force up. Because gravitational force is the force that acts vertically down. What acts vertically up? The tension within the cable. Why? The tension is a pulling force and it always acts away from the object. So here is the mass M. Tension acts vertically up. Gravitational force acts vertically down. So which force is greater? Gravitational force acting vertically down. What is the smaller force? Tension acting vertically up. So gravitational force minus tension equals MA. So by common sense, by common sense, bigger force minus smaller force equals net force. Net force is always mass times acceleration. Bigger force minus small force equals net force. Mg minus T equals MA. Mg minus T equals MA. By vector sum, if you assume that positive x is to the right and negative y is down, then we know that the gravitational force acts vertically down, so it is along negative y, so we put negative in front of Mg. Tension always acts vertically up for, the, for our case, yes. And what is the direction of acceleration? It is down, so we put negative Ma. And don't forget, these two are exactly the same. You multiply it throughout by negative 1, and what do we get? We get Mg minus T equals Ma. And that is the same as our first equation. So by common sense, mg minus t equals ma. By vector sum, we still get mg minus t equals ma. Do not forget, we already took into account the direction of acceleration due to gravity and the direction of acceleration. So you don't have to substitute negative 9.8 at this point. Everything is good to go. Substitute 9.8 for g. Do not substitute negative 9.8 because we already took the acceleration due to gravity as vertically down. What is M? M is the mass in kg. M is the mass in kg. What is G? The acceleration due to gravity in meters per second per second. What is T? Tension in newtons. What is M? Mass in kg. And what is A? Acceleration of the elevator. And this is George Matthew signing off. Good luck. Thank you.